Let me tell you something right now from experience. Upgrading all four heroes at the same time is not an easy task. Let me show you. What's going on, guys? My name is Joe, and welcome back for episode 60 of the Rush That Base series. Now, we must applaud those of you out there that are farming for eight hours or more a day for progress on your bases. Whether you're doing your walls or you're putting all of your heroes down for upgrade, you guys deserve a golf clap. <laughs> <laughs> for real because i put in three hours this morning with three different training boosts and we still are not full on our dark elixir just yet now we are up in masters league and i gotta show you the attack log look at this we got some serious dark elixir pool here but a lot of these bases are not dead bases a lot of these bases we have to attack for real now we're using baby dragons and we're sending in the battle blimp to take down the town halls with the electro dragon in the balloons but we got the you know the trade-off there is time and the trade-off there is also putting in the work and it requires a lot of work now if you are unaware of what we're doing here last week we took a look at our friend Pali that is also a rush based player and he had maxed out level 14 walls and very high level heroes and his guidance for us was have all four builders down on heroes and then dump the rest of your gold and resources into your walls and then just keep farming 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 and that is I'm gonna tell you right now guys that is not easy by any means but if you're really into doing that you can definitely keep up now I'm trying here I'm really really trying but I just don't have the time to put in eight hours in a session playing the game anyways we're gonna be putting down our archer queen today as well as our grand warden we're not full on our dark elixir just yet but I'm gonna activate another training boost and we're gonna get back Back to work and i want to show you some of this loot in masters league but i'm going to drop back down to about masters three real fast all right so we were on our descent back down to master three and we just so happened to stumble across this very dead town hall 13 so we're going to go ahead and take the loot off of this bad boy first now i gotta find where the dark elixir is at we got dark in the drill there and i think there's another drill I lost the drill. All right, let's just, <laughs> let's just go ahead and get some baby dragons down. All right, so we're currently working on uh, our clan games at the same time, and we were using the Sneaky Goblins. We used Sneaky Goblins all last week, and I just got a little burnout with it, and we're also trying to save Dark Elixir, so I didn't want to spend 50,000 Dark Elixir or 55,000 Dark Elixir on Sneaky Goblins right now. So we might activate those again later on in the week, but we're just going to work with baby dragons for right now and try to steal the resources that we need. All right, so we've destroyed three of the four air defenses, but we do have our archer queen. This is why we're going to hold on to her for a little while until we get really close to filling up our dark elixir storage, and then we'll put her back down for upgrade. All right, so let's go ahead and... Oh, man, I didn't mean to drop baby dragon there. What are you doing, dude? What are you doing? Come on, bruh. All right, so we got, let's see here. We got uh, air sweepers in the center of this base. We got a queen that needs to have her ability used. And we also have a royal champion that we can activate as well. So let's go ahead and use her. Let's use the royal, uh, Grand Warden's ability to get rid of that enemy queen. Come on, queen, be strong enough, please. Can you do it? No, she's not. Oh, no. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, God, that sucks. Oh, we did get rid of something in the center there, though. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, roast that queen. <laughs> And we're going to send that battle blimp in the core of this base to grab the loot. No, come on. All right. Okay. 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 I was just kidding. I was just kidding. All right. So let's see. Where's the rest of the resources? We got a storage over here, an electro dragon working. Can it be strong enough to destroy some buildings, if not take down the town hall? Highly unlikely at this point. Highly unlikely. Let's go ahead and drop another baby dragon to help with that wizard tower. And I'm really just after the dark elixir here. I don't really care about the town hall at the end of the day. We still got the win, even though we're technically supposed to be dropping. We're supposed to be going back down to masters, right? Okay, so we got the dark elixir out of the storage there. There's 359 dark elixir left in the town hall, if not the clan castle. We're going to go ahead and walk away from that one with a massive haul of loot. 600k of both and 5,500 dark elixir. Oh, here we go. Here's another one. <laughs> so I'm dropping right now. That's supposed to be the intent. But I keep getting distracted by these amazing dead bases like such. So you just can't help but take it down. And we have our queen and our grand warden, but no royal champion. All right, so let's see if we can go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and try to roast that queen. Can we get rid of her? Nope. <laughs> we completely missed her. It's all good, though. Let's go ahead and destroy this air defense here. One more right there. And we got another air defense over there. Is there any loot on this side? No, not really. 
no loot. So we got a dark elixir storage. So let's go ahead and roast this section right there. Get rid of the air defense. All right, so let's go ahead and get baby dragons around the base and keep this party going. Come on, hurry, hurry, guys, hurry. All right, drop baby dragons all the way around the base. We do not have to worry about an eagle artillery in this raid. That is always a good thing. And uh, we got to pay attention to our air sweepers, which I think I destroyed them already. Oh, queen was successful. Oh, man, the queen was almost dead there. All right, let's go ahead and send queen versus queen. Send in the grand warden with her to destroy these buildings since she should be able to reach them. Oh, man, I did not mean to click that warden. And let's go ahead and send in our battle blimp to the center of this base. Where is the rest of our dark elixir? Okay, dark elixir's got to be right there. And uh, hmm, let's see here. All right, battle blimp's on target. Let's go ahead and get rid of the town hall. Come on, balloons. You guys can do it. E-drag. Come on, E-drag. You can do it. You're strong enough. You're a powerful guy. All right, Queen's going to eliminate that drill over there, which is going to reduce us down to nothing without using any more baby dragons. No! We can't get rid of... No, oh, I guess not. <laughs> they just weren't strong enough. They just weren't strong enough. Let's go ahead and drop baby dragon there and one more there, and we should be good to get in there on that uh, dark elixir storage and grab the 165 dark elixir that's left in there, and we should be able to walk away from this raid. Now, remember, we're supposed to be dropping, but we're also trying to work on our clan games kind of casually, doing clan games, not really targeting it today, and that's one of the things. It's like some days I feel like just grinding clan games, and then there's just some days where I'm just like, yeah, I'll get it done in the next couple of days. No big deal, right? Some of you might play like that, right? Some of you, not all of you. I know the mass majority of you like to grind them all out in the first couple of hours of them being live. All right, so we're good to go there. Pulled a massive chunk. Let's go find another one. Now, to be real with you, you do not need to have siege machines nor clan castle troops to farm like this. You really don't. At the end of the day, it's just a matter of whether you're trying to keep the trophies or you're just dropping back down. So we just found ourselves another dead base and we're using the baby dragons and the lightning spells so we can go ahead and just like roast things like this. So we could drop a lightning spell or two here to destroy that drill. Actually, I guess you need three there. And you could do it again here as well and destroy that drill, which dropped off a little bit of resources off of this base. Oh, my hot land to that. <laughs> that is alive. That scatter shot is alive, bro. Oh, my gosh. All right, so we're going to use some baby dragons to pull some of the loot, but we might actually just take the loss on this because, remember, we're on a descent back down to Master 3. We're still up in Master 2 right now, even though it's showing a base that's in Crystal 1. All right, so this player has not logged back on in a while, which is not a bad thing, actually. It's not a bad thing at all because they normally just leave a bunch of resources available on the base. So we're going to try to pull off the easy loot and then just roll out because the rest of our Dark Elixir is in this drill or in this storage, and we do not have a Battle Blimp to go in there and take it down, nor can we use Lightning Spells to destroy it. So I think that's good enough, actually. I think we got a bunch of the resources off of this, and we're just going to go ahead and walk away and reset our army. Now, some of you out there might not believe in doing this, but once you get too high on on the bases or up in the leagues then you have to worry about hitting a live bases and you might not have the army to do that you ever had that moment where you're clicking next and you're like whoa all right there we go well we just found one of those moments right here so we got a very 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 dead base <laughs> this is a dead dead base all right Let's go ahead and uh, roast some stuff. Let's uh, zap or lightning these air defenses. I know how some of you guys get so triggered about the word zap. I'll never understand why or what the big deal is. All right, let's go ahead and drop baby dragons around here, destroy some buildings. We will take the win off of this base. At least I hope we will because we're working on our clan game, sort of. And let's see if we can destroy, hmm, where's the other air defense? Oh, we got an air defense in there. We got an air defense right here. Is that queen close enough though? Actually, we gotta wait for her to come around. So while she's doing that, let's go ahead and drop baby dragons around the bottom side of this base, around this side. Let's drop one there, destroy that wizard tower, destroy that elixir collector, and I missed it. I missed the queen again. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. Don't judge me. Don't judge me at all, all right? All right, so let's go ahead and release the queen. Let's release our grand warden. And we have a royal champion that we can get in there and destroy some buildings as well. Possibly destroy that air defense. Now, the dark elixir is right here in the center of the base. We can always destroy all that. So let's release our battle blimp and try to take down some of this stuff. Let's use the royal champion's ability. And let's go ahead and drop two lightning spells on that air defense. Let's go ahead and release our rage and destroy these buildings in this section now we got balloons that just came out of there uh where's my oh, my grand warden's getting beat down over there okay eagle you know, <laughs> the eagle's being targeted but our electro dragon is distracted oh <laughs> that electro dragon just roasted that poor queen all right so we got 647 dark elixir remaining on this base let's go ahead and drop it to go in after that storage and we have one more elixir pump and there's an elixir pump there 
so can we get the rest of the resources off of this base i don't really care about the town hall at this point i mean it is what it is it's not a big deal if you don't take down the town hall we still got the win regardless we're after the resources here even though there's a little bit of resources remaining in the town hall i think we can walk away and save the remaining nine baby dragons and walk away with a big chunk of loot not too bad overall right one minute 37 seconds later so you will occasionally find bases that are not entirely dead but they will have a lot of loot because the player hasn't logged back in for quite some time which is very nice actually so we're going to go ahead and start by dropping some baby dragons around here now we got a bunch of air defenses that we got to destroy first in order to be successful with this attack so let's go ahead and release our royal champion to take out that air defense now if you did not notice our royal champion is now level five so i was successful with upgrading it but we need to get it back down for upgrade again let's go ahead and use the ability to get rid of the air defense over here as well as a couple of other defenses and then she will eventually get taken out she is a beast though man straight up beast let's go ahead and destroy this air defense right there there we go not a bad drop i think <laughs> all right so let's go ahead and release baby dragons over here to destroy oh my gosh oh my goodness see a royal champion versus baby dragons is a pain in the neck man she is a beast against the baby dragons too come on baby d Woo, that was close all right we got uh let's see we got some air defense we could take out there and let's see what we got remaining we got loot all the way around the base so let's go ahead and drop baby dragons there 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 and we're gonna send in the battle blimp do we have a battle blimp yes we do all right so let's go ahead and put the warden on air mode and see if we can get the warden to follow some baby dragons in yeah let's do that right there and let's go ahead and release the battle blimp to go to the core of this base and get to the center hopefully get rid of the loot all right where wait 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 for it wait for it wait for it all right warden ability there it is let's go ahead and drop our rage let's go ahead and roast some stuff maybe <laughs> come on balloons yes get it get it boys get it oh my goodness so close all right oh my goodness we got one more drill right there let's go ahead and drop baby dragon here and here and looks like the town hall will fall we got the resources out of that one let's use the queen's ability right there boom we got the dark elixir that's exactly what we want and we're full on elixir oh man okay that's cool not too bad all right so we're gonna walk away from this raid not too concerned about winning let's see if we can get the rest of the elixir out. Uh, it doesn't matter it doesn't matter you're full on elixir right <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> way to go dude way to go all right so since we're full on elixir not worried about clan games we're gonna go ahead and put the warden down for upgrade just like this so we got five days and 14 hours we got a gold pass so naturally he's reduced cost uh than normal so that's a good thing for us so the warden is down for upgrade and we're gonna do i think one more raid and then we're gonna put our queen down to finish this out for today guys i have the royal champion but she's gonna cost us 136,000 dark elixir and the queen is just a little bit more expensive at 152 thousand so let me retrain and see if i can do a few more raids maybe not on cam and then we're going to be definitely putting the queen down and this is going to be our final raid for today masters league has got some monster loot boys if you are not aware of this or you if you are in serious doubt of the loot i'm telling you this is where it's at but just save some for me please because i need it i need it too all right we're going to go ahead and roast that air defense and we got an air defense and a sweeper right there oh man oh man let's do him yep oh yeah we got some damage there all right cool all right so we got dark elixir right here where there's a queen we got a monster queen let's go ahead and destroy that queen queen on queen we'll use her ability and get rid of her real fast <laughs> goodbye and let's go ahead and drop our baby dragons around this area destroy some stuffs and some stuffs and some stuffs and uh let's see here we got another air defense right there as well as, well as a sweeper all right we got rid of the sweeper we got rid of the air defense and let's go ahead and uh, see we got some loot right there we got some loot over here oh man there's a hidden tesla okay and let's go ahead and drop our royal champion to destroy this air defense and then we're going to go in and take down the town hall right where's the air sweepers I, <laughs> I don't know if i destroyed the air sweepers or not looks like we got all of the dark elixir off of this base it was mostly inside of the collectors themselves royal champions ability will be used and let's go ahead and send in our battle blimp and drop some baby dragons to help out a little bit come on battle blimp can you get to the center of this base it's very very dead it's very very dead come on we need the balloons to destroy the town hall let's drop our raid spell boom come on boys you got this ha 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 goodbye town hall and that is going to be it for today guys 
we're up to 236,000 dark elixir which is not too bad we still need to upgrade the dark elixir storage that's one of my top priorities but we're just we're trying to keep the heroes down that's one of the main intents of this entire process is to keep the heroes upgrading dump the gold into walls and on that note we're going to go ahead and without further ado i think i got a few more minutes left on this boost right 19 minutes i'll keep doing some baby dragons after the fact let me go ahead and retrain i need to get started editing this video because i have another project that's also due this weekend so let's go ahead and put this queen down for level 46 for the next five days and 14 hours will we end the boost yes we will we got one builder available let me just go ahead and do wall and wall because i want to do all white walls i don't want to upgrade any different colors because then i get seriously triggered in an ocd so we're going to go ahead and spend off our gold just like this and this will be another section complete right that's another section complete so all we have left is this upper half and we will be done with walls at least on the white walls we still got to go to level 13 and 14. so hopefully you're able to get something out of today's video guys masters league is a great place to farm and it's a lot of work but it can be done if you use your training boost and put in the work you know towards putting those heroes down again Good luck to you guys if you're a Rush-based player. If you enjoyed our content, make sure you leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you have not done so already. And if you like watching us every single day, turn on those notifications. If you need any additional video support or you want to see the Rush base from the very beginning, click one of those links over there. And we will see you in the next one, guys. Take care.